from the command center of the JW Solar USA. Today, this is what I have to show you guys. Finally, finally complete my assignment. And guys, you guys been seeing, I've been talking about generators and uh, look what I got. These are all running um, 241, 2240. If you see this one, I uh, just picked up this. And guys, look at this. A lot of outlets, you know, from a very nice uh, family. And uh, they have a fifth wheel and they upgraded to uh, 5,000 watts. You guys can see this is a Honda EG3500. And this one here is a Honda EZ3500. So um, I know I cannot pair this one or parallel them. But guys, but this is what it is. Um, this generator was, uh, was they were using this generator on a fifth wheel. And I think the demand is really higher. And they decided to get a 5,000 watt generator, um, Honda. So, and um, I have a good conversation with the uh, this um, family. And um, they told me everything about the generator. Even his son was really cool about it since, since I was in high school. You know, he just graduated. But it's kind of an interesting story. But I just, just want to share with you guys. And Honda generators last for a very long time. I'm not saying last forever like other people normally say. But it lasts for a very long time. So this is what it is. You see this Honda was, since they were moving, transported all the time, put it in the fifth wheel. Underneath the coach, um, where they put the luggages, whatever, and I uh, get some scratcher dents right here. It's okay. And um, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this guy out the tank and clean the entire engine so it can be a spanking new, looks really uh, chrome or silver. So if you look at here, the engine size is almost the same, is a the GX240. Okay, and uh, is uh, a 2.4, yeah, 2.42 centimeter, and here's the same engine here, the GX240, 2.42 centimeter. The engine is the same, the same, but the uh, the um, even the the motor, um, the quell, whatever, uh, it gives, uh, it's the same power. But the only thing is the output here, the outlet. It has a lot of features more than this one. See that? This is just a comparison of advantages and disadvantages, but I think the engine size is the same. Uh, if we look at here, sometimes it has shows how many um, horsepower. But, um, yeah, but this is what it is, guys. Um, this one they live in a big uh area, acre of land, so it's just sitting there, they don't use it, they don't use it anymore. So he decided to say they will sell it, yeah. It's like, okay, I'll buy it, and you know, it has a uh, 120. 25 amps and you have 125 volt 20 amps here it's just a total switch you can choose which one you want it's just 120 you can run this 120 here on this section a 240 and a 120 you can run simultaneously so look at these two outlets here this I give you 20 amps each and likewise this is a 20 amp as well. If you can see that, just clean that. 20 amp. So if you're talking about capacity, this generator can do a whole lot of things. And when it comes to 125, okay, 125, it gives about 30 amps here. Okay? It says 25, but 30 is the max. So on the 120, 125, this order, so another 125 here gives you 20 amp. It depends what you want to run. If a 20 amp out, output or 20 or 30 amp, 120, 25, 125, 20 amp, 
or 125 30 amp so that's a good thing about it so um, you can tell they use a generator where it, it travels a lot with a fifth wheel and it also have breakers here 20 amp anytime you see this one pushed in that means it's on and it pushed out that means it's out so the main circuit breaker here on and off so guys and take this check this out okay let's see i cannot read what it says okay 20 amp okay 240 20 amp is uh it's the nema yeah nema l1420 so it's a 20 amp here it's a 20 amp as well see the box here is smaller small box the box is huge gives you a lot of options so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna tell you guys what i'm gonna do with this generator after everything get done the exhaust the back of the engine it looks almost the same identical so i just want to show you guys um now the some people are gonna say wow john <laughs> J, jw solar usa now he's onto generators now he's gonna get a lot of generators so you guys see i'm just trying to get myself what i want and uh these are all what it look like the exhaust same thing looks like they run hot this one is more cleaner it has the brake on the back okay this one no breaker on the back the breakers are on the front so the same i think it looks the same and from there i'll bring here here's the yamaha okay here's the yamaha so this can do all the little things i want to do and uh it's quieter and i don't have to worry about anything about it it's just only um 120 see that i think it's around 18 15 15 amps something like that yeah around 15 no around 19 amps something like that 18 19 amps so correct me if i'm wrong well guys look at that so excited the only difference is the easy 3500 and the eg 3500 so i don't know the eg what it stands for i don't know what it meant but it's big look at the box look at the uh, distribution box right here the ac power box look at that one it's smaller it's almost very close to it's gonna be <laughs> uh, two of this one to one almost but you know let me say one and a half but this is what it is guys um i hope you like this and uh what you've seen and they're running great it's one pool they supposed to start right away thanks for watching like and subscribe jw solar usa love you guys all bye more cleaner this one is dirty just just like in the farm area where i got it